Trump administration touts a smaller UN budget and takes credit for it. The Trump administration said Sunday that the United Nations budget has been reduced for the coming year, and it framed any cuts as the product of U.S. negotiation. Among a host of other successes, the United States negotiated a reduction of over $285 million off the 2016-2017 final budget, the United States mission to the UN said in a press release. In addition to these significant cost savings, we reduced the UN's bloated management and support functions, bolstered support for key U.S. priorities throughout the world, and instilled more discipline and accountability throughout the UN system. A United Nations spokesman confirmed to NPR the reduction in the budget, and said the total UN budget for 2018 to 2019 is $5.396 billion. But cuts to the UN budget are typical. The 2016 to 2017 budget was roughly $400 million lower than the final appropriations for 2014 to 2015, which was 2.9% lower than the previous biennium's budget. The UN budget is negotiated every two years and is decided by consensus rather than a vote. Wealthier countries that pay the lion's share of the budget the US, Japan, Canada and EU members routinely push for the budget to be lowered. The wording of the US missions announcement, which called it a historic reduction in spending, led some to misread it as meaning the US was reducing its own contribution by $285 million next year. The extent to which the US contribution would be reduced isn't clear. This is also misleading, tweeted Bathsheba Crocker who formerly led the State Department Bureau that develops U.S. policy in the United Nations. The U.S. fights hard, together with other countries, every year to cut U.N. budget and regularly does. This is neither new nor a U.S. decision. The Trump administration has consistently criticized the U.N. and its spending. The United Nations has such great potential, but right now it is just a club for people to get together, talk and have a good time. So sad. Donald Trump tweeted a month before taking office. Just five months into our time here, we've cut over half a billion dollar 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 from the UN peacekeeping budget and we're only getting started, US Ambassador to the UN Nikki Haley tweeted in June. The inefficiency and overspending of the United Nations are well known, Haley said in a statement Sunday. We will no longer let the generosity of the American people be taken advantage of or remain unchecked. You can be sure we'll continue to look at ways to increase the UN's efficiency while protecting our interests. The US plays an important role in funding the UN, as the New York Times reports.